Praise the Lord Church. First of all, it's a very big privilege for this opportunity to present this testimony. I thank all the junior church teachers and most of all God for giving me this opportunity. Since the first time we visited this church, we have lacked nothing and have found out who the real creator and the savior of the world is. My whole family has been blessed, spirit baptized, water baptized, filled with the joy of the Lord. My mom has found a job and me and my brother have experienced enormous blessings in our lives. All our fights have been turned into peace and love. I'm happy that we worship the real God and are called the children of God. Matthew 5, 9 says that, Blessed are the peacemakers, for they shall be called the children of God. And Romans 8, 16 says that, And the Spirit himself testifies through our spirit that we are the children of God. I give all the glory to the Lord. Thank you. Ephesians 6, verse 2. Honor thy father and mother, which is the first commandment with promise, that it may be well with thee, and thou may live long on the earth. God loved me so much that he died for me on the cross. Psalm 16 verse 8. I have set the door before me. He is at my right hand. I will not be shaken. 2 Timothy chapter 1 verse 7. For God did not set the but of power and not of mind. Proverbs 18.10 The name of the Lord is a strong tower. The righteous run into it and they are saved. Galatians chapter 6 verse 9 let us not become weary in doing good, for at the proper time we will reap a harvest if we do not give up. Psalms, Psalms 34, verse 18 says, The Lord is close to the brokenhearted and saves the crushed in spirit. The Lord make his face shine upon you and be gracious to you. The Lord, uh, turn, the Lord lift up his the Lord lift up his countenance upon you and give you peace. Number 6, verses 25 to 26. I am with you and I will watch over you wherever you go. I will bring you back to this land. I will not leave until I have done what I have promised you. Genesis 28, verse 15. John chapter 16 verse 22 Now it is time for grief but I will see you again and you will rejoice and no one will take away your joy. Jeremiah 33 verse 3 Call unto me and I will answer you and show you great and mighty things which you do not know. 1 John chapter 5 verse 14 says, This is the confidence we have in approaching God, that we ask Him anything according to His will, He hears us. Isaiah 54 verse 10, Though the mountains be shaken and the hills be removed, yet my unfailing love for you will not be shaken, no my covenant peace be removed. 2 Corinthians 9 verse 8 The Lord is able to make all grace abound towards you that you always having all sufficiency in all things may have an abundance in every good work. Joshua chapter 1 verse 9 Keep this book of law always on your lips. Meditate on it day and night so that you may be careful to do everything written in it so that you may be prosperous and successful. Good morning, church. Surely God is my salvation. I will trust and not be afraid. The Lord, the Lord is my strength and my song. Surely he has become my salvation. 
Isaiah chapter 12 verse 2. Thank you. Psalm 55 verse 22. Cast all your cares on the Lord and He will sustain you. He will never let the righteous fall. John 16.33 I have told you these things so that in me you may have peace. In this world you will have trouble, but take heart, I have overcome the world. Isaiah 41 verse 10 So do not fear, for I am with you. Do not be mismayed, for I am your God. I will strengthen you and help you. I will uphold you with my righteous right hand. 2 Corinthians 1, 3 to 5 says that, Praise be to God and the Father of our Lord Jesus Christ, the Father of compassion and the God of all comfort, who comforts us in all our troubles, so that we can comfort those in any trouble by the comfort we ourselves have received from God. For just as the sufferings of Christ flow into our lives, so through Christ our comfort overflows. Isaiah 54, 17 But no weapon shall be able to prevail you. You will have answers to those who accuse you. I will defend my, peop I will defend my servants and protect them. This is what the Lord says. Romans 5, verse 17 for if, by, for if by the trespass of one man, death reigned through the one man, how much more will those who receive God's abundance, provision of grace, and of the gift of righteousness reign in through the life of the one man, Jesus Christ? Ephesians 1, verse 7 and 8 In him we have redemption through his blood, the forgiveness of sins, according to the riches of his grace, which he made abound toward us in all wisdom and prudence. Psalm 46 verse 1 to 3 says, God is our refuge and strength, and ever present help in trouble. Therefore we shall not fear. Though the earth give way, and mountains fall into the heart of the sea, though the waters roar and foam, and the mountains quake with their surging. Psalms 118 verses, uh, verses 14 to 16. The Lord is my strength and my uh, salvation. He so Shouts of joy resound in the tents of the righteous. The Lord's right hand has done mighty things. The Lord's right hand is lifted high. The Lord's right hand has done mighty things. 